In this video, we're gonna go from base eight to base 10. So if we're given a number in base eight, I wanna know what is it in base 10. Okay, a couple of fun facts. Some of you may see that six, and after watching the base five video, you're like, whoa, you're not allowed to use a six. Um, so in base eight, the digits that you can see over here are the digits zero through seven. So for eight, you can see any digit zero through seven. So if somebody wrote a nine in here, I'd know it was not correct, okay? All right, so now that we have 136 base eight, okay, and I wanna know what is it in um, base 10, remember we're in that weird <clears throat> made up country land where we have 64 cent coins, eight cent coins, and those pennies. So what this is saying is it's saying I like one 64 coin, three eight cent coins, and six one cent coin. All right, so let's figure out how much I've got. 64 times one is 64 cents, right? So one times 64, shall I write it that way, is 64 cents. Eight times three is 24. And one times six is six. All right, so now I wanna add all of these together. So if I add 64 plus 24 plus six, I believe, and feel free to get a calculator, I'm gonna get 94. All right, so the number 136 base eight is the same thing as the number 94. Okay, let's try another one. What if I had 237 base eight? Okay, and don't be afraid to grab a calculator. This class, we don't care if you're good at arithmetic, okay? So it's all right, you can grab that calculator. All right, so here, um, I'm gonna have two 64 cent coins, three eight cent coins, and seven pennies. Okay, so let's see. Two 64 cent coins. So two times 64 is 128. Three times eight, that's 24. And then I'm gonna have one times seven, which is seven. All right, and I think I'm gonna get 159, let's see if that's true. 128 plus um, 24 and seven is 31. Da, 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 da. Woohoo, my arithmetic was right. Okay, so what I have here is that 237 base eight is the same thing as 159. There it is, base 10. All right, it just takes some practice, guys. Keep at it. Our last base we're gonna talk about in the next two videos is binary.